Hi, I'm Graham the MSP. I'm the Minister for Transport in the Scottish Government. Um, you might ask how do you end up being the Minister for Transport in the Scottish Government? In my case, by a quite circuitous route. Um, I was very interested and very passionate about politics in my teens, um, but never really imagined it would be a career path. And um, I wanted to go and study electronic engineering. Unfortunately, that didn't work out for the simple reason that I um, failed my maths higher twice, uh, which was a bit of a setback. Um, I had to uh, rethink what I was going to do job-wise. Um, I turned to journalism. Uh, I secured the place at Napier University to study journalism, but I was also given a job offer and I took the latter. And I was incredibly fortunate to go on to have a 30 year career in sports journalism, the vast majority of which was you know, an absolute blast. But in 2010, uh, the opportunity to stand for the Scottish Parliament arose. I had been heavily involved in politics for quite a number of years. And I took that opportunity, I was fortunate enough to get that opportunity. And in 2011, I was elected to the Parliament. I've gone on to be Minister for Parliamentary Business and Veterans, and now more recently the Minister for Transport. I count myself incredibly fortunate to have uh, had these roles, particularly the transport role, which is very, very challenging, but very exciting. You know, at uh, the age of 58, go, turning 59, it's terrific to be able to get up every morning and really want to go uh, to your work. So I guess I'm an example, um, as we reflect in Careers Week, of someone who ends up with a, a dream job um, eventually, uh, perhaps by a circuitous route. And I think I think that's the thing for everyone that uh, things might not work out quite as they would hope early on in their careers, but there's always that chance that you're going to get the job that you would always have wanted.